Happy Leif Erikson Day. Uh, yeah, no, not really. So we've made it. We've now made it to Christmas of 2020. The big 2020 Christmas time. You know, watching all the Polar Express and all the other, you know, there's a big crisis at uh, Nakatomi Plaza, etc. I wanted to take the time to personally wish all of you a very, very wonderful Christmas. Or if you celebrate Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, any of the other holidays during holiday time, I absolutely wish that and the best of it to you. I think it goes without saying to say that 2020 has kind of a different vibe to Christmas this time. Because honestly, this year has been kind of rough. You know, 2020 has hit us with all kinds of craziness and really it's just, you know, a very different time. I wanted to take the time to not only personally wish all of you a happy holidays, but also to say that I know that a lot of us are struggling right now. I know a lot of people are going through financial issues because of COVID. I know a lot of people are dealing with either sickness from COVID directly or even family members or friends that are dealing with it. I know a lot of people are dealing with the fact that they can't see their friends or their family during Christmas time too. And I know that some of us are even dealing with loss from this year as well. And really a lot of that like festive kind of spirit that we feel during the holiday times is not really here this year for a lot of people. And there's just a lot of stresses in the world right now. There's a lot of things that are still going on. A lot of questions people have. A lot of unanswered questions at that. A lot of uncertainty. Like really, it's just a lot of things that can be very, very overwhelming during this time of year and just really throughout the whole year. But there is one thing I do want to highlight now that is a very, very big positive for all of those who are watching this right now. Because the fact of the matter is that despite everything that's gone on this year, you know, all the craziness, all the negativity, all the hardships and uncertainty, and all the negative things that happen, the fact of the matter is that you, you who's watching this video, are still here. And I think that's one of the most amazing and incredible things ever. Despite all the hardships, you watching at home, managed to make it through everything, and you're still here. Despite all the hardships, all the negativity, all the terrible stuff that happened, you are still fighting that battle. You're still here. It's now almost the end of 2020. You're going into 2021, and you've made it. And that right there speaks volumes that you were able to overcome everything that 2020 threw at you and you're going stronger into 2021 that is a huge accomplishment and something that you should be insanely proud of yourself for you know as cliche as it is going through a lot of these hardships ends up teaching us a lot of things it ends up making us stronger individuals when we come out of it i know that everyone's journey through 2020 is vastly different from another person's but no matter what, I am confident that all of you will be able to continue strong despite everything that's going on and come out stronger and end up happier. And we're just going to look back on this one day and say like, yeah, you know, that was tough. But we made it through it. I have big faith in all of you that that's going to be the case. Ultimately, I think, you know, as tough as 2020 was, there was a lot of positive that came out. I was able to reconnect with some people that I hadn't talked to in a while just because, you know, there was more time, honestly, and it really made me think about my life and connections I had made, and I was able to reconnect with some people who I hadn't seen or talked to in quite a while. It really helped me appreciate some of the things I had lost and really be happy that I was able to have a lot of the experiences I did. 2020 also was the year that I ended up getting married, you know, I finally said my I do's to May, you know, it was not the ideal situation with all the family together, but we were able to do it, you know, like a big like virtual wedding basically in the park, but it happened. I think it's easy to look at a lot of the negativity of 2020, but really I think what we should be doing is just really focusing on some of the positives that we were able to pull out of this. 
Look at the lessons we learned. Look at the things that we realized and come out of this much, much stronger. Like I said, to all those watching this video, you individually, you are an amazing person for being able to come out of this stronger and survive everything that this year has thrown at you. It's truly remarkable. So with all that said, my final wish for all of you is that you would all have an amazing closeout of 2020. No matter where you are, who you're with, I just pray that all of you will just be happy and successful with whatever you choose to do and know that I believe in you and know that no matter what, whatever you set your mind to for this end of this year, you will succeed and you'll go into 2021 stronger and even more incredible. That's my wish for all of you. I hope that you have an amazing day with whatever you decide to do today for Christmas or whatever else into the future. I am Jay Cheetah. Thank you again for watching. Keep out on the lookout for big things coming in 2021. Love all you guys. Take care.